December 4, 2021, over 250 people chanted Jade's name as she was about to make Warriors of Wrestling history, becoming the youngest female champion only 17 years old. This was the biggest match in Jade's career, going up against the three-time Warriors of Wrestling women's champion Nikki Adams. You can almost say this was a passing of the torch moment. Wrestling has been a passion for Jade ever since she was 11 years old, and once you get hooked on the wrestling bug, it is truly hard to get out of it. I was 11, and... Me, being the introvert I am, my mom went to this party with my sister, and I didn't want to go to the party because I don't like parties. So I stayed in the car, and I was bored. So I was on YouTube, I was scrolling, you know, whatever. And I came across, like, wrestling. I came across AJ Lee versus Paige. Like, and I watched it, and I was like, oh, this is good. I was like, I want to watch more of this. And then I just kept watching it until she came back, and then... I got home and was like, Mom, I want to be a wrestler. And she left in my face. <laughs> she was like, what? A professional wrestler at the age of 11 seems like a far-fetched dream many kids say. But Jade was determined her dream was going to become a reality. Watching and studying the likes of Brooke Adams, Alexa Bliss, and Chris Benoit, it was really AJ Lee that stuck out the most to young Jade. Yeah, I just watched a lot of AJ that day. I watched a lot of AJ and I was like, if she could do it, why can't I? Dreaming and executing your plan are two different things. Trying to find a wrestling school in New York can be difficult because there are so many, but luckily Warriors of Wrestling fell onto Jade's lap almost accidentally. Well, I was 15 at the time and my sister plays flag football. She's, I don't know how she, I'm eight years older than her. I think she was like seven. So she played flag football at Fun Station. Like this one time it was raining. So they went to Fun Station instead of doing it outside. And my mom heard a bunch of banging. And, like, I wanted to be a wrestler when I was 11. I was 15 at the time. But, like, people were still, like, laughing at me. Like, it was still, like, you know, a dream, I guess. So, she heard banging, and then she found Joe. And she was like, what is this? And he was like, it's wrestling. My mom was like, oh, my daughter wants to be a wrestler. And then if it wasn't for that one day, I wouldn't be wrestling. Warriors of Wrestling's 14th anniversary show took place on December 4, 2021. Jade was about to make history as the youngest champion in the company's history. As Jade's dream was about to come true of winning her first wrestling championship, the nerves and excitement were definitely a factor. Walking out of here, Warriors of Wrestling Women's Champion. I always get nervous. I don't know how people don't. I really don't. Some well, people... They, always, they always say, too, like, if you don't get nervous... You don't care. So it shows that you care. Oh my God. I care a lot because I get very nervous. I'll be like sitting there like, oh my God. And my opponent will be like, you're making me nervous. Stop. And I'll be like, I can't. Being surrounded by her friends, family, and fans, this is truly a surreal moment for Jade, especially after achieving a dream that was so far-fetched for young 11-year-old Jade achieving this goal at age 17. It was cool. I was emotional. I'm not going to lie. I was a little emotional. Did you like the match? Yeah. I liked the match. I liked it. I thought, I thought it was a really good match. I remember... No. And... I, I saw everybody and I was like, everything went mute. I was just myself, I was like, oh, wow, okay, cool. I was like, I'm the youngest world champ. She taught me a lot. I remember she worked with me a lot. A lot, she helped me. She guided me through the whole thing. The bond between a teacher and a student is always important in the wrestling business. The student also have to trust their trainers with the right decisions they make and with their safety in the ring. For Jade and Joe, they have a very special bond as Joe takes Jade with him to wrestling conventions so she can learn from multiple different wrestlers. Joe and Jade have also teamed up in a six-man tag so they could take on some arch enemies of theirs, which they respectively won working together to make sure that they could get the work done in the ring. Joe helps me a lot. Joe Joe's took me under his wing. He's helped me in like a short amount of time too. He helped me get, he showed, he showed me everything. He put a lot of time into me. 
Jade was also able to make history in another way. Her first title defense was the fourth ever woman's main event of a Warriors of Wrestling show. She was wrestling independent wrestling star Brandi Lauren, and she successfully defended her championship. I was nervous. I was nervous. Were you excited, though? Because, like, making the main event's a huge deal, and that was your first main event. I was excited, but I was very nervous. Actually, you know what? I was calm. I was calm up until, like, it's weird because when I'm back there and I hear bells ring, that means it's getting closer and closer. So every time I hear a bell, my heart goes to my stomach. I'm like, oh my God. So I'm sitting there and I'm hearing bells and I'm like, oh, I'm like, all right, we have time. Jade also gets the opportunity to learn from wrestling veterans as she works with wrestlers at different conventions. This gives her the opportunity to seek advice and network for more opportunities down the line. Like asking questions to the wrestlers, getting any sort of feedback, any sort of knowledge I could possibly get. Do you have a favorite that you've worked with so far that has given you the best advice? Brooke. What advice has she given you? Brooke has given me a lot of advice. She's watched my matches. She's helped me a lot. She's helped me a lot. I even took I, I took her clotheslines too. Being a representation for a female audience is a big deal this day and age. Only being 18, Jade can inspire many girls that in this male-dominated world, even women can succeed. Don't get frustrated. Don't get frustrated and like doubt yourself. I hate when people say they can't do it. Because I get that a lot. Like a lot of girls are like, I can't. I can't. Don't say I can't. If you didn't try, like, don't give up. It doesn't happen overnight. Like, I didn't. Time. I mean, it doesn't happen overnight. It took me so much time. Like, you know how many times I've been so frustrated with myself? And, but I never said I couldn't. Like, I always said I can't. Even if I thought I couldn't, which, they, of course, I've had my moments. I was like, no, I can. I can. It's either, it's either, you're thrown into the water and you could either swim or drown. And I refuse to drown.